I like you. You don't fit in around here either. Omega. To the Bad Batch Omega finally had a chance to meet with the Bad Batch when they returned to Kamino after the conquest of Kala, a conflict that had been suddenly ended by the execution of Order 66 and the end of the Clone Wars. During the proclamation of the New Order, Omega stood by Nala Shea's side and briefly made eye contact with the Bad Batch's leader, Hunter, only to vanish once he was distracted. Following the assembly, Omega approached the Bad Batch and introduced herself and addressed each member of the squad by name. When they asked what she was doing on Kamino, Nala Shea appeared and explained Omega's position as her medical assistant with a tendency to wander, before leading her away. Determined to grow closer to the Bad Batch, Omega sat with them in the mess hall, which Tech noted was something that had never happened before. Unaware of her true nature as a clone, Hunter asked where her parents were. Omega barely had time to respond when another clone trooper made a passing remark, taunting the group by referring to them as the Sad Batch. Taking offense, Omega threw food at the clone and demanded he apologize. Hunter tried to de-escalate the situation, but Rekka threw an entire tray of food at the clone trooper and started a brawl. Omega later tried to claim responsibility for the incident when the Bad Batch were called in for punishment, but Hunter refused, giving her a warning to stay away from their squad to avoid getting herself in trouble. Omega later stood by Nala Shea's side as she and Prime Minister Lama Su attempted to convince Admiral Wilhuff Tarkin to consider the Bad Batch an asset to the New Galactic Empire. However, Tarkin was more concerned about the squad's tendencies to disregard orders, especially since they had failed to comply with Order 66. Though she failed to comprehend most of what she overheard, Omega got the impression that Tarkin did not trust clones. She tried to warn Hunter as the Bad Batch was about to depart on a mission to Onderon, but he dismissed her concerns. Nonetheless, she insisted on joining them, suspecting that it was no longer safe on Kamino, but Hunter calmly replied that change took time to get used to before departing with his squad. Later, Omega and her droid companion RZ-3 entered the squad's barracks. Omega looked around in awe at their gear, especially the group photograph but was eventually discovered by a force of clone shock troopers that had come to confiscate the squad's gear. She was incarcerated and held in a newly constructed holding cell along with the Bad Batch, who were imprisoned following their refusal to act on Admiral Tarkin's orders to take out Saw Gerrera's rebel cell on Onderon.